Face Tracker. Zoom into your clip by 20% and add the transform effect. Click the toggle animation for position under transform, then activate the guides on the preview screen. Drag the guides to line up with the person's face. Move ahead two frames at a time, adjusting the crosshair to the new position of the face each time. Parallax. Increase the scale to 120, then duplicate your video clip and select the pen tool. Click and trace an outline all the way around your main subject and adjust the mask feather and expansion settings. Toggle keyframe for scale, move to the end of the clip and change the value to 140. On the bottom clip, move the timeline slider back to the start. Click the toggle animation for scale, then move to the end of the clip and change it back to 100. Impact Shake. Locate the impact spot in your video and insert a frame hold. Move ahead 10 frames and make a cut in the frame hold, then delete the remaining. Create an adjustment layer above the frame hold and then add strobe and transform to it. Adjust strobe duration to 0 0.01, period to 0.1, and random strobe to 75%. Under transform, Toggle a keyframe for scale and position and move ahead one frame. Change the scale value to 140, then adjust the position of your screen with a slider. Do this a few more times, adjusting the position each time to a new location to create the shake. Sky Replace Add your two clips on the timeline, the replacement sky on the bottom and main clip on the top. Add the color key effect to the top clip and then select the dropper and click on a part of the sky. Increase the color tolerance until your sky has been completely replaced. To correct any imperfections, create a mask around your subject or defects and then invert it. Adjust the mask feather and expansions to remove the hard lines around the mask.